Little, one, little guy, eh? Little walleye, little pike. Little pike, real little pike, not even worth the film. What you got? Cute, Ugly little pike, eh? Yeah. Maybe a big one will come grab it. You never know. You can let that one go, or uh, yeah, all right. <laughs> Exciting moment for Corey. He's got something. Could be a sucker fish. Could be a really nice trout. What's your prediction, Corey? I think it's a nice trout. You think it's four or five? Holy sh! Damn! And you got no net. That's five pound trout out of this nice zodiac, and you got no net. All I'm gonna say is good luck, buddy. No, you're grabbing it. You're grabbing you want me to grab it? I'm okay, well, let me tie a remote. Okay, but look at the size of that. Look at the size of that fish, man. That's when you'd really want to have a net, eh, Corey? Yeah. Especially when you're dealing with a fish of that size. Well. If you get them close, I can help you, maybe. But I think probably it'd be best oh. if you did it yourself. Like, grab them or flip them in? I'd say grab them, man. I'd say grab them. Bro, he's not hooking. Okay. Well, let me help you out with this, okay? Let me help you out with this if you think you need it. Bring him in close to me and I'll try Bro, to he's hand him. I'm not tired, man. I got I know. him under the mouth. Like, I, don't I know, I know. I, I see how you hooked him. Pull me some drink. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I just landed this fish for Corey. You want to tell him how I landed it, Corey? With your take take the hook off. Take the hook off. He's poorly hooked. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Take it's the hook off. Under his mouth. There we go. A nice little trout. Let's see the let's see the lures you were using. He's using the green jig with the half green short shoes uh, tail with the orange. Nice piece of worm. It's about a four or five pound brook trout there, Corey. Yeah, oh, probably four pounds. Nice fat four pound brook trout. Not so bad. Not so bad at all. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. Let me uh, let me get a camera shot or two of you. Okay. I just caught this little tiny thing, and I wouldn't keep it, but he swallowed it. This is the seedling, or the uh, the fry that they planted this year. And, uh, yeah, normally I'd let him go, but he absolutely buried this, so I don't have much of a choice. Uh, not much to look at as compared to that big trout we caught earlier. Now, this one here I lucked out. I didn't hook him too deep. He's really pale, and uh, luckily, the way that I hooked him here, he's not going to be damaged, so I'm going to let this one go. Usually a fish this size, try to try, try to keep him in the lake, you know what I mean, he's five, six inches, so we'll let him go. Okay, Corey, so you owe me 35 bucks, and uh, you haven't paid me up, so now, what are you going to do to start paying up, son? Eat this worm. What's it worth to you? Five bucks. Go for it. Mm -hmm. Open the hand, open the hand, open the hand. Swallow. Hey. I had enough. There we go. Yeah, man. Yeah, cool. Nice little trout. Yeah, let's flip him in. Good. That's a natural, too. Natural little brook trout. Just beautiful. Okay, well, let's put him in the cooler, okay? Okay, into the cooler. There's no water in the cooler. Put the cooler in, yeah. Okay, so I just picked up this nice little brook trout. I'm using this little tiny 16th ounce jig head and just rocking them on it. See how I just caught them right on the tip. They're being very finicky. Zoom right in on this fish. Look at all the black uh -huh. dots on them, right? Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful fish. All these black dots. Basically, it's these uh, parasites and the minnows that he's eating. And if he had cold water, he could get, get rid of them. But because he's stuck in warm water, he can't. These are a couple of fish we have already caught that are doing pretty good in our, uh, in our live work. And I caught most of those except for one, eh, Corey? One of them I hooked bad. Yeah. Okay. You're right. We're going to get some more. Disappointed with your camera skills, Corey, but I caught a little trout anyways. Yeah, three-minute rule. Three-minute rule. As long as you can catch the fish in three minutes, the camera keeps rolling. Oh my gosh. Having a hard time there, Joel? Having a really tough time. Pardon my French. Okay, for now. Brookie on. Today, nice natural one, too. Let me just move your drink here for you, Corey. There we go, there we go. Yeah, it's good. Woo. Perfect. 
and he tells me not to make a lot of noise. <laughs> hey, look at this guy. He's beautiful. He is just beautiful. Zoom in on that guy. Oh yeah, hey. Dark it's orange. Gorgeous. But What's going on, Joel? I just hooked into another nice brook. Another nice natural. We're gonna see if I can flip. <laughs> Fell off again. <laughs> Fell off right there. Special Olympics. Okay. Head. We're gonna let this one go. Shut her down. See, these are a couple trout we just caught. Everybody's happy, except for this guy. He's been unhappy for a long time, though. But as far as these guys, these guys are all happy, happy trout. Three, four, five, six, seven. We're gonna let him go now. Let's do it. Corey's feeling the need to jump into this water here to let these fish go for some reason. He's having a tough time. There we go. There's one. Here's number two. He's freaking gone. Here's number three. Number four. Five. And six. And sinking. And six. And this one here, because it's on its side, we're going to keep. Here's my big trout I caught. So check this fish out. This is the fish I just caught. What is it? I have no freaking idea. It's really weird. You get zoomed right night in that? Yeah. Big head. Fucking body, eh? Weird. Weird for I think sure. it's some kind of goby. That's what I was just gonna say. Hey. The one. Nice natural, really. Rocking. Cool, cool. Pretty cool, Mike's got nail, eh? I don't know. Colors Bright, on. nice and orange, eh? Yeah. Yeah, nice and bright, nice and Except bright. Except for the black dots. Beautiful. Perfect hook set. Damn, that was a big trout. A huge mother...